so today I thought I'd do a video on my summer must-haves. So, go through fashion stuff first since I don't have much of that. First thing I love are brightly colored t-shirts. I got this from a vendor when I was volunteering at the hospital. Many years ago, I did that for high school. I love all the beads and sequins on this. Very pretty. Next thing that I need during the summer, cute sandals. These I got at Target when I was in Buffalo three months back. I love this little detailing here. And although these look great, they're comfortable. I'm really grateful for that because it's not easy for me to find cute shoes that will not kill my feet. Next thing I need are cute little dangly earrings. Like these little roses here. My cousin's girlfriend actually made them for me. She's very into making jewelry. You can also find cute and expensive earrings at places like Claire's and Ardeen's. That's where I get a lot of mine. While I love wearing dangly earrings year-round, I think in the summer they're particularly awesome because they're just so fun and pretty. Next up is a fruity perfume. I used to be more into floral scents, but recently I've been loving the fruits. And this is my favorite perfume right now. It is Midnight Fantasy by Britney Spears. And yes, I am a fan of Britney, but that's not the only reason why I love this. I'm wearing it right now. It's hard to describe. I think I can pick up something a bit citrusy there. I also think there's some sort of berry in this. There's just a tiny bit of florals. I'm sure you can find an exact description of what's in this online. Alright, so the next thing is probably the most important, and I think pretty much everyone who's watching this, actually everyone in the world, should have one of these, regardless of who you are. Sunscreen. Because not only are sunburns painful, but too much sun exposure can also cause all sorts of unattractive looking things like sunspots, wrinkles, you get my drift. So there's also sunscreens out there. The one I like to use is Neutrogena Ultra Sheer SPF 45. Most important things to keep in mind, make sure it has an SPF of, I know most people say 15, I say 30. Add 45 since I am super fair and if I'm not careful, then I do get a painful red burn. The other thing is something not as many people think about, but it's just as important. SPF, it'll only tell you how good it'll protect you from UVB rays. Those are the ones that get you burned. However, there's another thing called UVA rays, and that'll give you the wrinkles and the sunspots, and yes, it can give you skin cancer. So you always gotta read the ingredients and make sure there's something in this that'll protect you against UVA. Mine has avobenzone, I don't know if I pronounced that right, I will leave it in the description below. That's the most popular one that I'll protect you against UVA rays. Alright, enough of the boring health talk. On to the next. Orange nail polish. And this is my personal favorite. It's Essie's Meet Me at Sunset. It seems like recently orange nail polish has become a huge trend, and I'm loving it. Last four things are all makeup. My first one would be a light blue eyeshadow. I think that's a fun color for summer as opposed to all the dark colors that get popular in winter. I got one swatched right here. This is Maybelline's Eye Studio. It's the quad in Spirited Seas. For a drugstore shadow, this is really good. You get a bit of fallout, but it's not major unlike some. Of course, you need bronzer to give you that sun-kissed glow. And if I could only use one bronzer for the rest of my life, it would definitely be Too Faced Chocolate Soleil. This is the perfect color for me. I got it right here. It's light, so it doesn't make me look dirty, but it also does not make me orange. But you also get an added bonus with this. So, y'all know by now I have a weakness for beauty products that smell good. This smells like chocolate. Right, so I love lip gloss, and in the summer, I think the best color is bright pink. I got my Revlon Super Lustrous Lip Gloss in Pink Pop here. There it is. I'll just say Revlon lip glosses are my favorites. So if you're looking for a great summertime color, I highly suggest this. You don't need to go spend, I don't know how much those MAC lip glosses are, but they're not for people on a budget. My final must-have is a peach blush. I just think it really warms up my complexion. And the one I have is 
a recent discovery and I'm in love with this. It is the Revlon Photo Ready Cream Blush in Pinched. See the color there? I have a swatch right there. And yes, I'm wearing a lot of these products that I mentioned today. I'll just show you a quick close up. This is gorgeous. And if you're thinking about getting these, I highly suggest you do. It said on the display at Shoppers Drug Mart that these are limited edition, which makes me sad. Revlon finally makes a good blush and it's only limited edition. So those are my summer must-haves. If you want to share yours with me, leave it in the comments or better yet, make a video response. I hardly ever get them on this channel. So that's all I've got for you now. I love you. Hope you have a great weekend. You'll see me soon. Bye. Where are you now? See ya. I'm sure you can look it up online. That was security to tell us there is a UPS guy coming. And I don't think any of us are expecting a package. Hope you have a great weekend and I'll see you soon. That was my old outro before one of my friends very thoughtfully corrected me.